Alright. We got all the sugar that we need. I think we're done. It says that we're one out of three. What the fuck? Okay, we finished the sugar. Okay, we, yeah, we did everything. Alright. We're out of here. I don't care that I'm almost on level nine for dagger. I just don't want to... I don't want to play this anymore, really. This is stupid. I'm actually getting a headache from how shit this is. So, let me rework the, the ranting that I was just doing. I hate how this is just... I hate how this is beta. Like, this has been out for a couple months or, or so. I... I, I really can't remember when this came out into beta. And it's... It's like there's been no improvements. I've noticed no improvements to these bugs that are making this so irritating to play. Like, here I am with a key and everything, trying to make the most out of it and record whenever the fuck I want. Or, or play whenever the fuck I want. I don't even want to play when I want, because I know I'm going to get a headache from playing it. I'm going to get pissed off. This is so this is so stupid. So, man, another message to the developers. You guys are fucking me up right now. That's all I'm saying. You know, that's not all I'm saying. You guys are fucking douches. This is stupid. Fix your game, man. I'm not going to say like, "Oh, I'm going to go head over to POR if you don't fix your shit." Because PR POR is probably worse than this fucking bullshit, man. God damn it. Sorry, guys. I'm just really angry. Alright, great job. Yeah, cool. Three salted ribs from phantom ships. What the hell? Oh my god. We're 87% done. We're 87%. We, we are almost done here. We've almost righted... Ridded... We've, all, we've almost gotten all of Greer's wrongs righted. Sure. But now we have to go destroy some phantom ships. Alright. If if this is like one of the last quests, I'm fine with that. We'll get this done. I just... I don't know. Oh shit, these guys are... Oh fuck. The detail all like came in at once. What the hell? That was really weird. Anyways. um, I think after this session, guys. I, I think... I think I'm going to stop playing for a little bit. And by a little bit, maybe like a month or so. Meaning, I'm gonna have to find a, I'm gonna have to play, uh, I'm gonna have to play something else. I'm gonna have to find a replacement for this playthrough. Well, there's a phantom ship right there. I like to at least be doing two things at once, so I'll have to find something else. But I, I hate to just put this on a hiatus, but this is just, this is just bullshit, man. This is, this is too much bullshit for me. Alright, time to see how difficult these ships really are. Maybe the AI is better. Alright, that wasn't that bad. To be honest, it's just like any other ship except the cannonballs. Every time I get hit by one of them, there's like a strike of lightning or some shit. And there's some more phantom ships over there. They're uh, pretty close by, so I'll go deal with them. And we'll get this shit done, guys. No worries. It's It's been a, a long session, to be honest. Like... Like I said, it's um, it may not seem like a long session for you guys, like maybe just two or three episodes out of this, but to me, for how much time that I'm having to put in, it's it's a lot, guys. It, this is this is too much for me, especially with all the uh, the shit that I'm having to go through just to get this shit recorded, the issues that are in the game that really don't belong in this game, especially with the time that they've had in beta so far it's uh it's pretty ridiculous but it, it makes this all the more irritating to record and all the more effort that's needed to be put into this shit so <sighs> whatever i'll get the shit done for you guys okay we're done with the salted ribs i'm actually just gonna teleport back to port royal because i don't care about the treasures that i found the real treasure is the time that we spend together, or whatever, but yeah, I'm too lazy to just turn the ship around and go back to port that way, I'll just teleport back. I wouldn't really say it's laziness, actually, it's just more of, I just want to get this session done as fast as possible. <laughs> Alright, uh, back to Lucinda, great thing this 
fucking game threw me on the other side of the island. It'd be cool if you could actually choose which side of the island you'd like to go to every time. Or maybe set a default. That'd be pretty fabulous in my opinion. Also looks like the map is fucked up. I saw my cursor just run off in the wrong direction. So now the map doesn't have a cursor to display where I am, where I'm headed. Which is just fantastic. The map is still usable though. I mean, I guess. But alright, Lucinda, we got your shit. That wasn't too bad, but I'd rather be doing something else. Great job. Hell yeah. So visit June. Alright, so... June told us to... Wait, did she actually tell us to right the wrongs? Not really sure. Where did fucking June live again? I think over here, actually. In the other street. Poor Royal is actually much smaller than they actually depict it to be in the movies. Or maybe it is this small. Who knows? It'd be nice if there was like an actual like town. Like a very... Uh... Uh, I would say, like, this town, but maybe, like, double or triple the size. Make it seem like more of an actual area. Maybe the same with Tortuga, but then again, I'm not really sure with Tortuga. Alright, June. So you've undone what my brother did. Not sure if he deserves a friend such as you, but I gave my word. Tell my Lieutenant Blakely that my brother has his forgiveness. Ooh. So what do we get out of this? Just, okay, just plus 100. We're 91% done. I feel like I feel like Blakely's going to be like, Now hold on a second, bucko. We ain't done yet. There's one other thing I need you to do, and that's going to be like the big one. We'll probably have to like kill some guy and his guards or some shit. It'll probably be something like that. Because I think there was something similar that we had to do for uh, Carver or Pidgeley or whoever the fuck his name was. Alright. Blakely, where the hell are you? I don't know why you don't live with June if you're seeing her. I'll never understand that. Unless Disney's like, oh no, can't have a couple living together. That's just too much. That just doesn't make sense. Or something like that. We're almost on level 16. Let that brigand go on June's orders. I may be smitten with her, but I take orders from only my superiors. Who are... Wait, who are gone at present... So, I'll release Greer on one condition. There we go. I told you guys. You do a job for me first. While the Navy doesn't officially recognize the undead vermin on Port Royal, I am unofficially charged with eliminating them. Confusing, I know, but deep in a cave called Murky Hollow is where undead pirates muster. Disrupt their unholy ritual, and you can buy Greer's freedom. Hey, man, that works for me. What do we got to do? Uh, defeat 10 undead brigands. Those are pretty good. And we have to defeat General Bloodless. 1,000 XP. I hope that levels us up. I can't... I can't see the status on the top left. It's blocked by numbers that you guys can't see, which is pretty good. Also, I'm not exactly sure if even the screen resolution and everything with YouTube will even let you uh, see the progress, which is unfortunate. These, This interface, this HUD, is really small, and I resized it once, but it, I think it reset it. Which is really stupid. But hey, that's that's the Legend of Pirates Online. Got so many damn issues. Now I don't remember if we were supposed to turn right or left in here. I I wanna say it's left. I wanna say we're gonna have to take a left here at the Governor's Garden. I think right will take you to uh the Navy place. And I think left will actually take us to Murky Hollow. I'm not sure. Is that ray of light? Or that light ray, or whatever the hell. Um, that doesn't that doesn't help us. It really doesn't. Oh wow, I was right. We are actually headed to Murky Hollow here. I can't. Oh, wh okay. Uh, never mind. We're actually headed to crashing. I think at this point it's just too much to ask. Just you know, not crash. Just to you know, have some smooth sailing to the end of the session. It, it just won't happen. It just really won't happen. Alright, second time's the charm. Murky Hollow. Come on. Give us Murky Hollow. Come on. Come on. Yes. We made it. Oh my god, that was... 
That was one hell of a trip. Alright, I have absolutely no idea where this bloodless guy is. And we're supposed to be killing brigands. I'm not exactly sure those are the... I don't know if those are the guys that I struggled to find, like, the first time. I think it was. And I remember finding, like, a whole bunch more. If I just continued down the path that I found. So... I guess I'll just have to see if memory serves and I can actually find where the fuck these brigands are. Okay, this is the spot where I found the brigands last time. Or this brigand at least. It was just this one guy that I focused on. So I'll, uh, I'll deal with this guy. I'll find out where the hell, um, God, fuck off, bat. Seriously. I'll find where this, uh, general guy is and... We'll get these quests done. It, sh it shouldn't take us too long unless I crash and decide to take a break for another four hours. All right, I found the cesspool of undead brigands, but I am yet to find the general. I don't know where he is, but I'll keep my search up. No worries, guys. I'm also about to level up my dagger, so I'll keep talking until I kill this guy. So I can just continue on with the commentary. Hell yeah, we even got a little loot bag here. That's cool. Uh, wait, hold up. Let's see what we can get here. Oh, nothing new. That's that's great. Um, we don't get the next combo skill until 14. Uh, oh, we get finesse. I guess that's next. I'll give this to gouge. All right, I should probably attack because at this rate I will die. Okay, guys, I found General Bloodless. And I found another uh, undead brigand, so that's that's definitely something. This trip over here wasn't that big of a waste. But it looks like I got the attention of this bitch when I wanted to kill this guy first, so that's lovely. Oh shit, we're level 16. I was wondering why I was lagging there for a second. So we're going to switch to the uh, sword here because I feel like this will uh, ensure victory, you know? I feel like nothing will go wrong. Well, this is indeed a foe to not be reckoned with. He is destroying my anus, so I'm gonna have to hella use that potion right there, or tonic, or whatever the fuck these cool kids call it. But damn, dude, this guy's tough. He's got a lot of uh, health on him. He is uh, definitely a tough foe. I mean, I mean we're, we're gonna win. I mean, it'd be weird to lose to this guy. I mean, he's level 12. Even so he may be a boss, you know, he's level 12. You gotta keep that in mind. We have a level 10 sword. We are level 16. We are also number 1. You guys saw that coming. I know you did. If you didn't, then what the fuck? Oh, now I'm attacking this guy. Oh shit, I got a chest. I got a shitty pistol and I got gold. Hell yeah, we got hella gold though. And now there's a lot of uh, texture glitches with this guy. Jesus Christ. But I'll get the... Uh, Brigand's quest done now. I think uh, General Bloodless himself was a, um, an, un an undead brigand, so that counted towards the quest. That's perfect. This guy should be it, and we will finally be done. I cannot believe it. I'm very happy. I am honestly... Wait, why am I holding a bottle as my sword? You guys see this shit? What the fuck? All right, whatever. We're done. So we can return to Blakely, and we can turn this shit in. Even so, we're already level 16. I thought, um, I thought finishing these quests would actually get us to level 16, but whatever. I'm pretty content with that. It seems like every session I'm leveling up at least once, so that 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 works for me. I mean, it's progression, and we need all the progression we can get right here and now because after this session, I'm gonna call it quits for a little bit. We're still holding a bottle in our hands. I'm not exactly sure why, but yeah, after this session, guys, I'm just going to call it quits for a little bit because this is this is stupid. I'm tired of the issues that the Legend of Pirates Online has, so I'm just going to call it for a little bit, let the game update, and hopefully the issues are addressed and fixed by the time that I resume the playthrough. I mean, it's not like I'm just going to stop recording for a long period of time. I'll be back before you know it. It's just, this is ridiculous, guys. I can't do this. Holy XP, boy. Great job. Hell yeah. So, we go visit Gordon Greer now. I guess we can go free his ass. But since this is a quote-unquote MMORPG, like I said, quote-unquote, um, 
he's probably going to continue to be there. His NPC will at least continue to be there. That's how these things usually work, especially in World of Warcraft. An NPC tends to not move their position even after a quest or a quest line. It's just how it is. Nothing you can do about it. It's, it's how these games were made. All right, Gordon Greer, I come to you to free your ass. You're already standing up with anticipation, but I have come with a key to unlock your chains and let you join the crew. Oh, I guess you went back into your normal stance. I can't believe I'm actually looking forward to sailing with Captain Jack. It usually ends badly sailing with him, I mean. Fair winds to you, mate. And there you go, you'll just... Sit there, telling me about how fishing is a thing. Alright, so I guess the next thing to do is to visit Josh Me Gibbs and get our next quest. But, I don't have to wait until next time. So, I don't know when next time will be. I really don't. Um, I guess technically we're not done with, uh, with the Gordon Greer shit. And it looks like, it looks like we have another quest line that just unlocked. Recover the famous portraits the nine robes that's something i don't remember but it looks like we have to go visit elizabeth swan for that maybe that's something that we'll wait on for next time as well whenever next time will be so i thank you all for watching this has been one of the most frustrating recording sessions i've ever had to do in my life and i honestly mean that but whatever i'll just edit this shit and get it up to you guys i'm still holding a bottle for some reason but yeah i hope you guys did enjoy I'm sorry that I have to step away from this game for a little bit, but it's extremely frustrating. I am not having fun, and if I'm not having fun, then the videos are going to be absolute shit because commentary is not going to be as best as it could be from me. So I'll come back to this when I feel like it's time. I took breaks from Toontown Rewritten when I was doing that playthrough, and I still finished it. So I, I do plan on finishing this playthrough. The game is just not in a... Uh, it, it's not best to record this game right now, I would say. So I'll come back in a month or so, maybe less, who knows. Depends if I can find something to take this place for a while, so I'm not just uploading one thing. And uh, we'll just hope for the best, hope that things are better, and hopefully the content will be better than it has been, and I won't have to uh, rant about the game and, the, and how shit the developers have been recently in terms of progression anymore it'd just be nice clean and i can compliment the developers it'd, it'd be great it'll be something i could even look forward to so again thank you very much for watching thank you for all the support and the recent episodes and the entire playthrough actually it's been fantastic that you guys are really enjoying this shit and so yet again i am sorry that i have to step away from this but i am posting other shit on my channel right now and i hope that you guys will check that shit out in the meantime but this will return eventually and uh yeah look forward to it so until then, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys whenever I come back to The Legend of Pirates Online. Take it easy, boys and girls.